everybody, it's Dana. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you another watercolor palette. You guys know I really like to watercolor and I just wanted to add another thing to my repertoire of supplies. <laughs> All right, so this is going to be the Missions Watercolor Palette. I love this, love all the wells. I can get so creative with this, love all the colors. I think this is gonna be a great addition to how I'm going to watercolor. The colors are really, really bright, vibrant from what I've seen in other videos. So I wanted to share with you how I'm going to put my palette together. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. In each one of their, these boxes, there's nine tubes which that's going to be 36 beautiful colors. I'm gonna pull out one of the tubes so you can actually see how big it is. So there is quite enough paint in there that I can probably get several palettes just out of this one tube. So what I'm gonna do is put everything, I'm gonna put that tube back in there the right way and I'm gonna flip all of my boxes over so it's going to be in the way how I wanna create my palette. So let me just go ahead and pull out my first one. And I don't need much of this. As I said, this is a pretty big tube. So since I don't need to put all of the color in there, I'm just gonna squeeze out a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and put this right back in the box. Now, what I need to make sure when I'm putting my palette together is that I slip the colors back in the same order of how I squirted them into each one. So when I go to label them, I will have all of my colors lined up correctly. Because if I don't do this, you guys, I'm gonna totally screw this up because I'm not gonna remember what my colors are. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and finish doing this off camera and then I'll be back to show you what I've done. Alrighty, everything is now laid out and now I'm gonna need a grid for this so I can see how my colors are gonna look. So I went ahead and I trimmed down a piece of paper to sit right in the side of this and then I'm going to go ahead and color swatch out each color so I'll have me myself a color palette when I'm done so all I'm going to do is slide these up here I'm going to keep them in the same exact order so I don't mess anything up because if it's going to be messed up then I'm going to do it all right I'm going to bring this into here I'm gonna grab me a water brush and I'm going to go ahead and start coloring in each one of my squares. You know what, I'm gonna actually take it out of here. And now I'm gonna color in, get that off camera here. I'm gonna go ahead and color in each one of these. I'm not gonna use too much water because I really want to see what the color is going to look like. So I'm just going to go in to each one and line up my colors. Now, that is a little bit too damp for me. So I'm going to go ahead and sponge up some of that excess water because I want to get more of a true color with not as much water in it. There we go. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna skip over each one and lay down all the colors. And when I'm done, I'll be back. Alrighty, so there it is done. This is all the colors that we have here. Let me lift this out. So very pretty and vibrant colors. I went ahead and I wrote next to each one what color it is. And I'm also going to take some packing tape once this is dry and put over the top so I don't smear my colors. Some of these colors went on a little bit easier than other ones. Some of them I realized worked very quickly with water, where some of these over here were a little bit thicker. But I will have to say I'm going to love this watercoloring set. I think it is well worth the money. And look, I have almost whole tubes left that I can totally make a couple more palettes out of this by mixing certain colors 
or I can set them aside and use them as a later date. Well, that is it for today. Just wanted to share with you guys my new water coloring set. And this is the Mission Gold Classic. And um, yeah, I think it's something that's gonna really help me explore another way to watercolor. Thank you guys for hanging out with me today and I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.